I would now li like to ask Ms. Hilary Whiting to give the valedictory address. Provost Becon, Vice Chairman Amir, Deputy Provost Ostingi, distinguished guests and participants, fellow students, families, and friends. It is my honor to present this address and to congratulate each and every one of you for your four, or maybe more, years of hard work and dedication that has truly earned you a spot here today. Today, we graduate and leave behind the rigorous schedule of assignments, labs, and exams that is engineering school. And we enter the world ready to take on new challenges. Although we've studied in different streams, there are certain lessons that we must all take away from our time here at Concordia. The first is teamwork. Yes, when you sat down to write your final exams, you were alone, just you and your calculator for three hours. But on the road to each of those finals, we weren't alone. We had the company of our peers. We learned to work together through group study sessions, lab partnerships, group projects, and tutoring one another. This ability to work with others and the ability to ask for help will serve as well in the professional world. These tools of communication and collaboration open up the possibility to learn from one another and those in different professions long after we've left the classroom. The second lesson is about understanding our role as engineers in society. Many of us may have chosen this educational path because we possessed an innate talent for mathematics and physics. But we have learned over the course of our studies that the designs that we put forth as engineers have implications that reach far beyond what the calculations and numbers disclose. Our professional work either directly or indirectly shapes our physical environments. Our innovations will improve global connectedness and increase access to communication between all corners of the globe. And perhaps, most importantly, the solutions we will soon devise will deliver hope and possibility for future generations to live in a safer, more sustainable world. The final lesson that our education at Concordia has equipped us with is the ability to problem solve. What sets engineers apart from other professionals is that we're highly trained in solving practical problems. Throughout our studies, we focused a lot on the how. How will this road get built? How will we generate this power? Or how will this engine operate? But out in the real world, we must also not forget to consider the why. Why is this road being built and is its design justified? Why is power being generated here and in this way? Why is this engine considered to be safe, economical? Why is this a good design? And is there a better design? Solutions developed in the past are no longer sufficient to address contemporary challenges within modern day realities. Today, we need to take a step back and understand the complexity of the problems we're seeking to address in order to create holistic, sustainable solutions. With these lessons in mind, we enter the professional world prepared to be actively involved in tackling today's most complex problems by being both mindful of the role we play in society and capable of working with others to overcome practical challenges. And of course, none of these lessons would have been realized without the help of those around us. On behalf of the graduating class of 2014, I want to deeply thank our loving and supportive parents and families. Without you, this journey would have been unbearable. In addition, let me thank our fellow classmates who inspire us and with whom we've endured this journey. And let us not forget the learned members of the Concordia faculty who so skillfully guided us on this memorable path of discovery. It's because of these people that we're here today, and it's because of these people that we leave here today with the tools we need to change the world. The end of our time here at Concordia is not the end at all. Instead, it marks the beginning of a whole new world of opportunity and intrigue that we may now explore. Congratulations, class of 2014.
Very well done, Hillary. Thank you.